Hello, hello. Um, I'm well aware I'm starting this makeup free. <laughs> so we can do it through the mirror instead of right on my face because it's not looking great right now. Um, this mirror is also, oh, it moved really, really dirty. Um, so sorry about that also. I thought I'd sit here with you instead because it's a little bit better. Um, but I thought I would start, um, I want to say like weekly vlog, but we are at Thursday already. So it's not really weekly, it's kind of four daily <laughs> um, because I went for laser hair removal yesterday. That's on my Instagram story, it was. Um, I'm going with a girl called Hayley Aesthetic Studio, I think it is. I'll link her in the info box um, and she's amazing. Um, so I wanted to tell you about that and then I went for my review of my hormone test results today. Um, I know a few of you asked on Instagram about that, but I think I'm gonna do like a separate video on that. I might just like show you a few of the vitamins and stuff that I've bought now, but then I'll do a separate video like explaining all of that. Um, I'm going to Nando's tonight with my mum. I haven't been to Nando's in God knows how long. I genuinely cannot remember the last time I ate food in Nando's. Um, not for any particular reason, I just haven't been there. Uh, so that's tonight. Um, tomorrow I will be at the office. I'm going to take in my desk and things from the house because I tend to not do any work when I'm at home. So I'm going to take the stuff to the office um, and set up in a little room there. Obviously, um, you may or may not know, I share an office with my best friend. So there is a spare room in there that I'm going to put all of my desk and things in. Um, so you can come with me setting all of that up. Then on Saturday, I have work at the football stadium. I don't really think I can take you to that with me, um, but I might be able to get some like little snippets and stuff on my phone. Um, and then Sunday, I am going ax throwing at Go Ape in Southampton. It's a gifted experience. It's something that they've invited me down to try. Um, I am all for the, I was gonna say passive aggressive, sports but it's not really passive it's more just like aggressive sport so I'm all for the aggressive sports and I just think it would be so much fun so I will take you with me there and I really 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 want to start doing this every week for the last three days I've been meaning to pick up my camera and just either chickened out or been like no I can't do it so ah, we're gonna start now we're gonna do this I'm making a pledge and we're gonna do this we can do this I also wanted to show you these two bowls that I bought. They are from Arigi Bianchi and I saw them on M. Sheldon Home, like her home account, and they're these cute little bowls. They do like a big, like a big salad version as well, but I got the two little like cereal and fruit bowls because I like to have fruit and things for breakfast. So this one is like, I think they called it a kissing face. And then this one is the smirk face. And I just thought they were so adorable. Um, and she had like a 30% off code or 10% off code. I can't remember what it was. So I got these and I also got, hi Dusty. <laughs> I also got a little candle from there as well. So, oh my God, please ignore the cracks in my wall. That's embarrassing. Um, this is fur blossom. Blossom, balsam. I can't say that word. I sound like an idiot saying that word. But I just thought it was nice. Kind of went with the desk. Um, and I think they offered free delivery over a certain amount. So I just added a candle to the basket. Do you not want to play with me? Come and play with me. Come and play with me. You're boring. I'm just going to catch up with some work and things. Got my little slippers on. These were from a brand called Shopbox um, and they basically do like these cute little personal, sorry you can stop looking at my toes now, they basically do like these cute little personal, this is what having a cat is like. <sighs> anyway, they do these like personal styling boxes where you can get loads of cute stuff um, like home stuff and clothes and things um, and they came in one of those boxes. So I'm just going to get some work done for now and then I need to get ready and go to Nando's. I'm probably just going to wear my tracksuit. I don't know if that's really like trampy but oh well, comfort is key.
morning. I have no idea if you can see me or not because I don't normally do these in the car, but I am just on my way to a meeting. I've got a product content shoot um, and then taking all my desk and stuff to the office. It's all in the back of the car. So that's all happening today. Then I am going out for dinner. I'm going to Harbour with one of my best friends, Charlotte. So I'll take you with me to that. I haven't been to Harbour in ages. Um, I'm one of their ambassadors and I am signed up to the gym. I haven't been to the gym in forever. But I've got the spare car for today. We call this the beast um, because obviously mine was in the garage for a long time. If you were following me on Instagram, you would know, like you would have seen what happened. Basically my engine broke down. Um, so I had to get it replaced. And then the garage that did it also fit, replaced my turbos, which fixed a lot of things. And then when they gave it back, it looked like they played bumper cars with it. I have since spoken to them and they have agreed to pay for all of the paintwork to be redone um, or like touched up. I think it's called detailing. So that's happening. That's happening. Um, in May I think it is so I'm gonna use the beast for now until I've taken all the stuff to the office because I don't want to put like the desk and the chair and stuff in my car and then once that's all done I'll probably get my car back maybe tomorrow definitely this weekend because I do miss my car I love this one it's faster than mine and I'm less precious about this one but oh well I'll give it back the only thing about this one is because it's older, I have to connect my music like through a wire and it's really annoying. But anyway, first world problems, but yeah, I need to give this back soon. dippers in chocolate that would be nice do you remember the ones that you used to get in a pot i used to have those all the time yeah with the chocolate mm -hmm. in the blue pot mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. they were the best ones they still sell them we need to get them yeah. can we get like a we need like a snack. cupboard of snacks no, and then we fill it up really fat <laughs> and then we can get a treadmill <laughs> so this is the room got my desk in here now a little chair and then I need to get some kind of rug or something to go here maybe like a chest of drawers or like a bookcase or something just to put this stuff on here um, got my little candle and then also a radiator cover to put over there um, maybe some pictures to go on the wall if I don't get shouted at <laughs> mm, <no>. <laughs> <laughs> fine <laughs> Damn it, please. <laughs> okay, fine. Good morning, everyone. Oh, we, we're sitting. Good boy. Well done. Um, today is Sunday. I didn't film anything yesterday um, because I was at work. I was at the stadium. This is really bright. I'm sorry if you can't like really see me very well. Um, but I can't really take my camera on film at the stadium, so... Uh, didn't do anything yesterday. Um, today we are going axe throwing at Go8 in Southampton, which will be fun, so I'll take you with me to that. Um, and then generally just having like a lazy Sunday. Straight for this afternoon, and before we get started, we just got a relatively safe. 
and you've got the metal head, the ads. Whenever you're picking the axe out of the log or the target, just make sure you're grabbing it by the bottom there and levering it out. And if you want to pass it to anyone, like a pair of scissors, just pass it, offering the handle. An art hand, loosely at the bottom, bring your non-dominant hand over, like that, over to the nape of the net. And this time, as you step forward, go a little bit further forward and lunge. As you bring it over and release, it has a tendency to go a little bit higher with the two-handed throw. So just drop into a little lunge as you release. You don't need to put any effort into making the axe spin, it will spin by itself. So, the effect to start with the heavier axe is, but if you find this too heavy, you do have a lighter one. So, uh, let us know if you're finding this one too heavy. There we go. There we go. So, so, you'll find it's not all about the power, it's about the throw. Have a few practice throws. Try to spot where, which bit of the axe is hitting the ball. Yeah. Like non dominant foot forward. That's it. That was terrible. Good throw. I think you'll find it easy with the two, I do. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Take care. Thank you. <laughs> what are you doing? You're not allowed up here. There you go. Say hello. My name's Apollo. Say, I've been a very good boy. Look at you. Mr. Handsome. Yes. Yes. You're so pretty. Shake my hand. Thank you. Good boy. You're so beautiful. You gonna do it? You gonna do it? You want the ball? Come on. <laughs> You're lazy today. Come on then. Are you ready? Steady. Go. <laughs> That's it, bring it back. Good boy. Come on then. <laughs> Are you getting tangled again? Move your paw, please. Come on. No. <laughs> what are you doing? everyone so I'm back home now um, axe throwing was so much fun I wonder if I can put you that's a bit low down anyway axe throwing was so much fun um, it was so much harder than you think it would be there's a lot of technique involved um, it was hard but it was so much fun uh, then just took uh, Apollo for a walk um, in the park and then my brain is like fried because I have so much stuff to do and then I start my ice skating course next week which is half an hour every morning so I have to be there at like nine o'clock every day and it's like 40 minutes away <laughs> uh, but just doing some house bits probably need to do washing up 
and then get to bed early. I might do some laptop work in bed because I've got some things that I need to do. Um, and then it's my granddad's birthday meal tomorrow. I need to go to the office this week. Uh, there's a lot going on. It's very busy. However, I hope you've enjoyed spending the last few days with me. The next one will be a whole week. So I will charge the camera tonight and pick it up again tomorrow. And we will do another week. Um, yeah, and there's lots of exciting things happening. I know, Dusty. I know, it's exciting, isn't it? <laughs> Uh, thank you so much for watching, um, I'll leave anything in the info box below and I will see you again next week. Can you say bye to all your fans? <laughs> louder? That wasn't louder, that was quieter.